bloody witch. Oh, okay. We've got two syringes, which is good. We've got a magnum. We've got plenty of ammo. So I'm in a good. I'm in. I'm in a good. I'm in a good way at the moment. I don't know how long that's going to last, but things are looking up no. for the time being. No, not that way. No. Okay. Haven't you figured it out yet? Oh, he loves tormenting others. Has to let them know he has the upper hand. Lays out the bait. Gets his victim all worked up. His unholy traps. It was happening to me. I could I'm just see being quiet. Just listening to what he says, out. guys. I could see it, but I couldn't turn back. I had to know. I had to know the truth, and he knew it. Uh, Mystique. Uh, sort of. I don't really play them games much more. When I was growing up, I used to play a lot of Tekken. I used to play. Every, I've played like Tekken one, two, three, four. Tekken Tag Tournament. Fucking Tekken Five. I've played. I used to play Tekken a lot, but it just got a bit boring for me. There was, it was just the same old. It was the same old all the time. It's like with FIFA. I'm not really into that anymore. I used to play that all the time, but I'm, I, I just don't play it anymore because it's just the same thing every year, and I refuse to pay. I refuse to pay like top dollar, thirty, forty quid for a game that really hasn't changed that much. But I got, you know, what's your opinions? What's your thoughts? Do you play a lot of fighting games yourself? As I can moan, complain, we're actually we come back here, so we haven't got that many skill points, but chaos. How is the evil then ever going good? You'll be murdered. <laughs> what should I buy? This or a Aaron, mate? It's, it's up to you, buddy. It really is. It's up to you. Um, it's whatever you prefer. If it's your preference. If you prefer horror games, then I would say definitely buy The Evil Within or The Alien Isolation, which is out on PS4. Uh, what's this? What's that? Oh, we found a, an old newspaper. Okay. Assassin's Creed is a, is a really good game as well, but if I was you, I would buy both of them. If you can afford both of them, then get both of them. But, like I said, mate, it's entirely up to you. It's whatever your preference is. Bloody Raw 3. To be honest, guys, I've never played that crate. I've never played that game. Somewhat, but I play... But I play COD. Yeah, yeah, Mystique, mate. I play Advanced Warfare with Fury. Uh, we play a lot of Advanced Warfare. It's a really, really good game. Um, it's a hell of a lot better than Ghost. Like, in my opinion, it's a hundred times better than Call of Duty Ghost. Call of Duty Ghost was an absolute disaster. Apart from Extinction. Yeah, Aaron. I, in my opinion, because I have, I don't, I don't play much of Assassin's Creed. I would go for the Evil Within, but it's entirely up to you. It's whatever you feel comfortable playing, whatever you're happy with. If you want to be scared, if you want to have a good ex a horror experience, then I definitely say go for Alien Isolation or the Evil Within. I've streamed them both on Twitch, and they've done incredibly well. And they're really, really good games. Rosy red cheeks. That's what I. That's what I've probably got at the moment. I'm really hot, really hot. It's quite hot in this room. Right. Let's see what we can upgrade with thirteen thousand. Not a lot. I wouldn't suggest. Ah, but we have got that magnum now, so maybe we could. You know, we've got a bit more choice. Is there enough blood in this game? <laughs> yeah, I think there would be enough blood in this game to uh, satisfy you, mate. QQE? It's a fantastic game, mate. In all, in all honesty, it's a really good horror game. If you're into that sort of thing, then go out and buy it straight away. Same with Alien Isolation. That's another fantastic game. The best Alien game ever made, in my opinion. It's fucking brilliant. Scary as fuck. But anyway, let's get down to business. Let's see what else we can upgrade damage. We don't really need to upgrade my pistol because that's already doing quite well, killing off the enemies. Uh, clip capacity, critical, no, see, I'm, I'm not really bothered about that at all. Um, clip, I'm not really bothered about that. I just want to, like, try and get the best out of the guns, like, I'll try and upgrade the power, obviously. Uh... 
run up stock. Right, do you know what? Let's just upgrade the the Magnum. I think we're just going to upgrade the Magnum. And that'll do. That'll do. Is this game hard? Yeah, Aaron, it is quite hard. Um, what are all the scary games you have played? Uh, <laughs> Resident Evil for one. Uh, lately that game hasn't been that scary. It's been more of a fucking adventure. So I'm really looking forward to playing. Well, I'm going to be streaming Resident Evil 1 when it gets released on the PS4 on the 20th. Yeah, we've reached uh, we've reached 33. We, we I think we've been up to 34, 35 viewers tonight. So again, like I've said, thank you for all your amazing support, guys. Uh, but I, I've played uh, Alien Isolation. I'm playing The Evil Within. Uh, what other horror games have I played? Um, I've played Alien vs. Pro That's not really a horror game, to be honest. But I've played all sorts of horror games. I've just got, I think Last of Us can be classed as a horror game, but I don't really see it as more an adventure game. Um, Dead Space, I've played a lot of Dead Space. Uh, I, I love my horror games at the end of the day, they're absolutely fantastic. I love my horror games. Basketball267, alright mate, welcome to the stream. I've just received a friend request from Aaron H underscore 1999. I will add you mate, as soon as I have completed this stream I will add you. And like I said, guys, if any of you has got me, if any of you has got me as friend requests, when you see me on playing the Evil Within, The Last of Us, I'm usually streaming it. So it's just a little reminder that if you're not doing anything, and you want to come along and have a nice chat on the stream, you're always welcome. I tell you, that music is so fucking creepy. It really is. Uh, Four, yeah, I have heard quite a bit about uh, Resi, Resi Revelations 2. I'm going to be getting that, and I'm also going to be streaming that. And I think we're going to be doing that as a, a co-op, so I could be doing that with either Fury or Inferno. I don't know yet, but I definitely will be streaming that game as well. So, you know, next few months on Twitch is going to be all about Resident Evil after I've completed this. Is there anything else near I can pick up? Uh... Oh, what's that? What was that? What was that? Oh, yes, there we go. Some more skill points. Nice. Yeah, The Last of Us is, am it is amazing, Aaron, mate. If you keep an eye on it, I'm about, I think I'm about halfway through. I'm not too sure. But um, I will be streaming that on Thursday. Same time, 7 GMT. If you're on, if you're free, come and have a little watch. Uh, well, I guess we've got to go uh, down the stairs. Yeah, for you, it does look good. I would suggest getting the remastered version of uh, Resident Evil 1 as well. I think that's going to be bloody good. Oh, and some more health. Thank you. <laughs> Chaos, if I turn 80, 40 quid, will you buy Far Cry 4? <laughs> oh, fucking hell, boo. <laughs> uh, that's another thing, guys. Um, you don't have to donate. You can if you want to. We've had donations in the past from very kind people. But if you do plan on donating, it will just go on stuff that we need. And I might as well use that because then I can pick up another one there. Yeah, yeah. To be honest, Aaron, it shot me. The story at the start of that game where he's with his daughter and his daughter gets killed. I don't think I've ever seen that really in a horror game before, or any game. Where you with your daughter and all of a sudden she just gets killed. It's like, fucking hell. It was like really, it was a really, you know, really big eye opener. And I've got too much ammo again. Great. Boom, mate. Honestly, mate. <laughs> You might want me to. You might want me. You want. I'll get my words out properly in a minute. You might want me to play it, but I, mate, I don't want to take forty quid of your money off you, mate. You're only twelve years old. I'd feel really guilty taking it off you. If I could afford to go out and buy it, I would. But I'm not sure if it's my type of game. And if I get, if I get it and then I don't like it, then I've just wasted forty quid. So that's why I like stick to the games that I enjoy playing that I know I'm gonna like. Oh shit! What's that? What the fuck is that? Oh shit! Red eyes. Oh wow. Oh god. Yeah, yeah, 4 mate. Oh, my God. Can you remember when Resident Evil 1 came out? 
Oh, that was so good. The tyrant shot the face when you met the hunters for the first time. The mansion. Do you remember the cutscene? The film cutscene from the original Resident Evil 1? Oh, man, that game was amazing. Yeah, but boom, I just feel so guilty, mate. It's... <laughs> I, I I can't tell you not to do it, but I, I wouldn't want you to do it, mate. I'd want you to spend it on something that you want to spend your money on. I don't need, I don't want your money, mate. I really, it's your heart. You're you're 12 years old, mate. You should be going out playing games or playing with kids or whatever you do your age. What I used to do, just just spend it on yourself, mate. Seriously, I I just I just feel so guilty. I really would. Oh fuck sakes. You completed the PS3 version on Survivor. Survivor mode! Wow, Aaron, mate. That, that, that must have took some doing. That must have took some doing. I'm only playing it through on normal at the moment because I, I tend to do that with games if I stream them because I've never played them before. I just go through it on like, the basic setting, like on normal, and then uh, just go up. Like I, did, I, I streamed Alien Isolation and I started that off on. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, what is that thing? There's nowhere else we can go. Oh, great. Okay, that guy's got lights coming out of his fucking ass. What the hell do we do? Boom, I'm not being pissy with you, mate. If you want to donate 40 quid, then I'll buy it. But I don't want to take the money off you. I just, I would feel so guilty. You're one of our most... You're one of our best followers. You're here every single stream like MC. You're only young. I want you to spend the money on yourself, mate. I really, you know, I just feel, I would feel guilty taking it off you. Uh, we don't, like I said, guys, we don't beg for money. We don't want your money. If you want to donate to us, then go ahead and donate. But we don't ask for it. We'd never ask for money from anyone. It's like when Inferno dudes fuck this game. <laughs> What's the matter, Zero? Uh, have you played it? Do you find it hard? Or I don't know what I've got to do here, but, you know. Let's just fucking go for it, man. Fuck it. Oh, shit! <laughs> he had bombs in. Oh, fuck! Oh, good aiming, good aiming. Oh, shit. Fuck. I did not expect that. I did not expect that. Shoot the red lights. Yeah, I did, man. I did. I didn't, uh. You will give me 50p next month. <laughs> How about dying like yeah, Q Q E mate. I've had a look at that. That seems like, that seems like a lot a lot like Dead Island. Is it? And that's like day and night, but I, I'm not sure. Forty two viewer high. Oh my god, you guys are incredible. Thank you for the amazing support for this game again. Oh shit, not made me fucking jump. Cheers, Aaron mate. That was mad. I thought I was gonna get blown to fuck there. That was some good aiming. Oh shit. He's been tangled in the fucking... In those traps and not managed to get out. Poor bastard. That must have hurt. Ow. Oh, I'm guessing it's that way we've got to go. But uh, let's have a look through this door. Oh, shit. How'd you put the fucking light on again? Uh, the light's already on. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh. Cheers, boom! And uh, I'm not being, I'm not being, yeah, I'm not annoyed at you or anything. You know, if you want to donate forty quid, I would buy Far Cry, but I don't want it off you, mate. If I had the money, I'd go and buy it myself. If we really needed to do it, I'd go and buy it myself. I know you like the game. I know you probably love to see a stream, but we can only do a selection of certain games. We can't play every game out there. It's like a lot of people want want us to play GTA Five, and I think Fury could be streaming that soon. So that's another. That's going to be another big game that we're going to be able to stream for you. Uh, QE, yeah, there's a big poss definitely a big possibility that I will buy DLC for this game. Because I've heard that it's going to be story DLC. And... It depends how long it is. I could probably, you know, I could probably get one stream out of it. If it was, I don't know how long the DLC will be. If it's something like uh, Outlast, like Whistleblower DLC, then you might get a few streams out of me because that was quite long. But it just depends how long the DLC is. It would be nice if it was like a few chapters, like maybe an extra five chapters. I have seen Dead Island 2, Aaron, and we will probably be streaming that as well when it comes out. When does it come out? It comes out in a few months, I think. Now, that looks absolutely brilliant. To be honest, I played the first one, and Dead Island Riptide was... I thought it was shit. I really did. 
Yeah, Aaron. Yeah, you could, mate. Because me and Fury are going to be streaming it. Hopefully in a month, maybe a month. I'm not sure. I wouldn't mind buying it again on the PS4. I could trade my PS3 version in. But I think it's that way. So let's have a little looky up here, shall we? Yeah, KG, you can play with me, you can play with Fear. If we get it, then of course you can play with us. We do some online multiplayer, we could do chases, we could do fucking um, heists, we could do anything. Just just, just a relaxed stream, that'd, that'd be mad, it'd be really good. Really good. Alright, we, we seem to be picking up a lot of ammo at the moment, which is... Yeah, Dead Island 1 was a really good game, but in my opinion, you have to play it with people. If you play it on your own, I didn't really like it, but I preferred... I liked it how you could play online with people and do the story at the same time, so it was really good. And I need a mint. My mouth is getting so dry. <sighs> Fucking hell. Yeah, Dead Island Riptide, mate, that was really bad. Joseph? Oh, shit. Uh, right, okay, right. Is it this way? Because if it's this way, I didn't check out what was back there. Right, okay. I've just received a friend quest from QE. Um, I will add you, mate, as soon as I finish the stream. Oh, Riptide, yeah, that was it. That was shit, mate. It, it was proper crap. Wasn't very good at all. Alright, as I'm thinking it's this way... Where's that fucking hole we came in through? Where's that hole we came in through? Yeah, I'm actually eating. Well, I'm eating extra, extra, extra strong mints. So... Whew, I'm burning like fuck now. <laughs> Well, we can't get... Oh, man, we missed We missed that. Fuck's sakes, there might have been something in there. Oh, well. Nothing I can do about it now. Chaos, go... Bear grills up in here. I don't know what you mean, Boom. Uh, I don't know what you mean, mate. Um, yeah, Riptide wasn't very good, but this Dead Island 2 looks... That looks... Looks a really good game. <coughs> I really enjoyed the first one. The first one was awesome. Spent hours playing that game. Aaron, mate, have you got, um... Have you got... Yeah, it was good, wasn't it, wasn't it KG? All, all the, uh... All the different weapon combinations you could make and shit. Uh, oh, that was really good. You could make a lot of different weapon combinations in Dead Island. Which was quite fun. Man, the support for this game tonight has been great again, guys. We've hit 40 viewers, 40 plus viewers, so I just want to say thank you again for your, your support. Oh, boom, fucking hell, that's disgusting. I'm thirsty, but this mint is sort of like satisfying at the moment. I'm, you know, this mint's sorted me out. I just had a really dry mouth. I need something to suck on. Right. I'm just waiting for someone to fucking jump out on me. This oh shit. Oh fuck. What's gonna happen? Someone's gonna fucking come out. Oh, hello. What's he shooting? What the fuck is he shooting? Oh, no, no, not that dude again. Oh my god. Help. Oh god, now what? Oh fuck. Oh, this is not good. Alright guys, we've had quite a bit of a chat there, but I think things are going to start hotting up now, so I might have to be a bit more quieter and concentrate on the game. Oh, where's this dude? Shit. Resident Evil 1 is coming out, I think, on the 20th of January, but I think it's only accessible, or you can only get it on the PlayStation Store. Oh, I don't know what's going to happen here, but... Let's just reload our guns. 
Fuck! What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? What the fuck are they? I'm just uh, deactivating that trap. What is that? What the fuck? What was that like fucking flying saucers or something? Oh shit! Oh no, shit! Oh fuck me! Shit man, this is mad! Look behind me! Oh shit! Turn it off, turn it off, turn it off, please, 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 turn it off, turn it off, turn it off. Fuck, 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 turn it off. Oh, shit. Oh, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, fucking hell. We've got three, I think we're going to use one. Oh. Should give us full health, yep, yeah, there we go, full health again. That is good, that is good. Right, Jesus man. Whew, fucking hell, that was crazy. Alright, okay, okay. Yeah. Foy, how's that Resident Evil Revelations working? What well, look, it's giving me so much ammo, but I can't use it. Oh, this is not good. I'm fucking chucking away ammo here. Fuck. Oh, shit. Uh, anything? Lovely, lovely. Just what we need. Yeah, again. Look at this. Ten. Oh, my God. 20 bullets there, I cannot do anything with because I, sh I should have uh, extended my capacity on this pistol, shouldn't I? What a plum. What an absolute plum. But we are picking, we are, we have got quite a bit of ammunition, so which is good. It could have given me sniper ammo instead, couldn't it? I shit myself when that fat box head came back to the <laughs> Oh, it happened to me, mate, just a minute ago. I don't know if you were there watching the stream, but I, I was that. Box head, then that remind me of like Pyramid Head from Silent Hill. <laughs> Fucking hell. But I thought I, I thought I killed him, and then I walked into a room and he was just there, staring right in front of me. I was like, fuck! Shit! He just scared the shit out of me. It doesn't, it makes it so much harder because you're playing in the dark as well. I've got my curtains drawn. I can't see a fucking thing apart from my bright fucking TV screen. So I've got, I'm on fully, full, full 180p, so it's like the sound's loud. Oh god, it just literally fucking scared the shit out of me. Oh shit. Oh, what's looking at me? What's looking at me? What is fucking looking at me? Oh, now we're in a meat locker. Oh shit! Oh, there he is, there he is, box head, box head! <laughs> but I'm guessing we have to deal with him again. Oh no! You again? Oh Jesus Christ Almighty! Ah! Shit! Fuck! He moves so fucking quick! Oh shit! Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? I can't fucking see! Ah! There he is! There he is! Whoa! Shit! This guy's scaring the absolute fucking. Oh wow! Oh shit! Fucking die! Uh! Oh man, not good, not good. But he must be going down soon, man. I hit like five into him. 
Oh, what have I got? What have I got? What have I got? Let's test out this fucking magnum, man. Let's test out this magnum. Let's test it out, man. Come on, you fucking bastard. What's he doing? What is he doing? He's not attacking me. He's not attacking me. Why ain't he attacking me? The guy is just staring at me. The game's glitched. He's glitched out. Use my exo ability. What is he doing? What is he doing? Well, while he's fucking standing there, we will de deactivate these traps and get some points. Get some skill points for it. What is he doing? Seriously, he is not moving. Okay, this is a bit fucking freaking me out now. If he moves all of a sudden, it's going to scare the absolute fucking shit out of me. Stay where you fucking up, mate. Look at him, look at him. Seriously, you tell me that don't look like Pyramid Head. He looks like Pyramid Head. Or Chainsaw, or the Texas Chainsaw Massacre with a fucking box on his head. He's tired, mate. Yeah, he's tired. He needs to calm down. I don't... Yeah, but I don't even know if it's an actual glitch, guys. This could be a glitch. Because he isn't moving. I don't know. I honestly don't know if what's going on. Or if he's going to come back alive in a minute. I, I don't know. But this gives us just a little bit of a chill time. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. 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 Oh, what am I doing? Stick that there. We've got another thousand points. I don't. Do you know, do you know what? Just stay there, mate. Just stay. Kill him. I'm not. No, I don't want to do anything to him. I'm not touching him, mate. If I can get through this door without him touching me, which would be an abs. Oh, sh he's just staring. Look at him. He's like he's glitched. He is literally glitched. I, I think I have to kill him. I honestly think I have to kill him. Fifty viewers, guys. Fifty viewer high. Thank you so much again. This is the best. I think this is the biggest support we've had for this game. The most viewers. It's amazing. Thank you for coming on. And we're just gonna. Honestly, I don't know what to kill him with. That's, I don't know. Should we? Let's put that there and then just stick my pistol back there. Well, is he gonna die? Is he gonna fucking die? You die, please fucking die. Thank you. Bastard's dead. No. I swear to What's going on? What's going on? Oh shit, he's fucking back again. Let's just pick up that and let's get the fuck out of here. Let's go, let's go. I don't know, I honestly don't know what happened there, but he j it glitched. Alright, Sergeant underscore Lomas, welcome to the stream. We're playing some evil within here. This is chapter 13 we're on. God I don't know what happened there, guys. What was what was wrong? Seriously, it's like he glitched. He just he just stood still and was just staring at me. His, his head was just moving. When he see me, it was moving. Like fucking Peter Crouch when he does the robot. Left, right, left, right, up, down. What the fuck? That was really weird. Oh, but uh, welcome to the stream, Sergeant. Um, is this your first time you've been on our channel? Have you watched Furies or Inferno stream before? If not, I would urge you to f hit that follow button. I don't like asking for follows, but I would, you know, honestly love if any of you could follow us because we are a growing community. We have over 2,200 followers on Twitch now, and we, we're just a friendly community. We want to get to know you and... Like I said, if it, if it weren't for you guys, we would be nowhere. You know, if we didn't have you guys to come in here and watch us, then there'd just be no point at all. So thank you again for your tremendous support. 57 viewers, man. This is the, mo this is the most support we've had on this game. I've hit 40 viewers before on the Evil Within, but I don't think I've ever had above 50. So this is just incredible. Thank you so much, guys. And I hope you're enjoying this game. Better find yeah, I, I don't want to ask people all the time, Lomas, because I don't, you know, I don't, 
want to put people off. I just want you to enjoy. I just want you to enjoy it. I just. I want you to enjoy us. That's all. We we stream seven days a week. We do the likes of Clash of Clans. I do the Evil Within. I do Last of Us. Uh, we do GTA. We do RuneScape. Is he invincible? I do not know, Aaron. I'm guessing you can kill him somehow, but he keeps coming back. So, thanks for the follow, D Sin One. Thanks for the follow, Lomas. Thank you so much. It is a great game. It is a fantastic game. It really is. Oh, oh. But I love it. Do you know, it's, it's, it's scares. This game scares the shit out of me because I play it in the dark. I have my windows. I have my windows shut. I have the curtains pulled. I play it in the dark. And I absolutely love this game, but it does scare the shit out of me. Like I said a minute ago, that box head or whatever he's called, I was walking through a door. And I just killed him, and then he reappeared, like, right in front of me, and it scared the absolute shit out of me. It really did. Uh, thank you again, Crate62, for the follow. This is fantastic. We're having a really good night here, guys. I didn't expect this. I expected to get maybe 15, 20 viewers tonight, but to get over 50 viewers is absolutely brilliant. Thank you all for your amazing support. I, you guys are just... I, I get lost for yeah, words sometimes right. of how incredible she you are. This is 46 people just watching the stream, and... Oh. Anyway, back to the game. Right. He might be a boss. That he yeah, he seems to have been with us all the way through. Same with that Assassin's Creed guy. So I don't know whether we have to kill them at the end, or... But mind you, that Assassin's Creed guy, he could kill us at literally any time, because he touches people and they just die. So I don't know whether he was trying to help us, or I don't know if he's trying to help us or trying to kill us. But I don't think he's trying to kill us because he would have killed us already. I think I got my words mixed up then, so yeah. Right. Another box. Anything in there? Nope. I need to try and ex I need to try and extend my ammo. I really do. I need to try and get Oh shit. Shit. Oh fuck, fuck, fuck. What we gonna end up go have? What's gonna end up happening next? I do not know. But what? That's another thing I like about this game as well. Is it's different. Every chapter you play, it's different. You fight a different boss. You're in a different location. It's not the same thing over and over again. It's just something new. It, it really is. It's a, it's a great game, and I, I, I'm not surprised because the guy who created this game made the original Resident Evil so you know 59 viewers man Jesus Christ I wasn't sure if I should get this game uh, Sandy Gobolts 55 um, I would definitely suggest buying this game um, if you've never played a horror game before or obviously you've played a horror game before but this game and probably Alien Isolation are probably two of the best survival horror games on the PS4 at the moment. Uh, Brad M. King Zero, welcome to the stream mate. We're playing some Evil Within. We're on chapter 13. Is this the first time you've been on our channel? Oh my god, I've just broke my record guys. I have broke my record. 67 viewers. 67 viewers. I previously held the record on Alien Isolation where I got 60 viewers. We've just hit 67 viewers. Thank you so much for your fantastic support. You are absolutely amazing. Thank you so much. I really don't know what else to say. Don't patronize me. I have orders. I can't let him have this boy. The game, Aaron, mate, the game's brilliant. It really is. It's one of the best games I've played on the PS4. Along with like The Last of Us. I'd just like to tell you there's 67 of you here now. So I'd just like to tell you that we stream 7 days a week. I cover The Last of Us and The Evil Within. Um, Fury plays GTA and RuneScape. And Inferno streams Clash of Clans. And there we go. Wow. There's chapter 13 clear. What? An incredible chapter. That was really, really good. 
But guys, that is not the end. I've only been streaming for one hour and 42 minutes. I'm just going to go for a pee quickly. I'll be back in a one minute. I'll do not go anywhere. I'll be back straight away.